My name is Dr. Keith Singer, and I'm the headmaster here at Donaldson Christian Academy. And Donaldson Christian Academy, or DCA, is an amazing community. One of the things that our alumni consistently say about our school is they use two words to describe our school. They often will use the words community or family. I'm Janelle Forte, and this is my second year teaching at DCA. I have a son who attends here. He's in fifth grade. My husband works here as well as one of the athletic coaches. Uh, DCA means so much to our family. We are all Wildcats at heart. I've been here, this is my 27th school year. DCA has been a big part of my life since 1996. I have been a teacher at DCA for several years. This is my 41st year to teach. And I've had children graduate from DCA, four daughters, and now my grandchildren attend DCA. My family and I came to DCA after Hurricane Katrina hit New Orleans. And I was looking for a place where my children could be safe and have a good positive learning environment. And so I came to DCA first as a parent and then fell in love with it and came as a teacher. This family has walked alongside me and my husband through most of our adult years. All three of our children have grown up here since they were babies. Our oldest son graduated in 2018. Our youngest son is a junior this year and our daughter is in fifth grade. My uh, youngest son graduated from here and now I have two grandchildren here. The reason I've been here for almost 25 years um, and loved every moment of it. Uh, my daughter's gone through uh, DCA, so I've seen it from a parent's perspective and from a teacher's perspective, and uh, it's a wonderful place. It's, it's very special to me and my family get emotional talking about it. Our mission and what we're about every day, and we've got amazing people who live this mission out in our classrooms every day, is we want to develop Christ-like leaders they're gonna go out and serve in their homes, churches, and communities. By providing a rigorous college preparatory experience taught from the perspective of a biblical worldview. And so we're gonna integrate faith into learning in every academic discipline. One of the things I love um, about DCA is that it is, is very faith-based and very focused. And uh, to me, that helps us not kind of wander in what we're trying to do, what we're trying to accomplish with our kids. Um, it gives us a clear direction from, from year to year, so we're not chasing what might be happening um, in the larger scope of education. Uh, this is actually my first year at DCA. I've never worked in a school where Christ is at the center, where when teachers say they're praying for your kids, they're actually praying for your kids. Um, coming from public school setting to a private school setting has been a huge difference in our family. It's been amazing to see the Christian atmosphere that blossoms from elementary through high school. I have personally experienced the warmth and love and support of this DCA community. My children have been wonderfully loved and excellently educated. Our oldest son um, graduated very well prepared for the world outside of high school. And not just prepared to succeed academically, he was prepared to stand firm in his faith. It's the people who are there, the people who love and care about each other. Um, and everything we do, it's Christ is at the center. And I think when that's a part of your life, y'all can't do this. <laughs> My name is Alice Prentice. I'm the academic dean here at Donaldson Christian Academy, as well as the director of middle and high school admissions. DCA offers a rigorous academic program with a wide variety of extracurricular activities. DCA has approximately 800 students across preschool, elementary, middle school, and high school. That gives us the opportunity for students of all ages to work together and be mentoring each other, and for our teachers to have longevity with the students that they serve from three-year-old all the way through. Our graduation ceremonies are a very emotional process for our teachers because they have known these students for their entire lives. I love DCA so much for a lot of reasons, but one reason as a teacher is the smaller class size. Um, because I have a smaller class size, I'm able to work with students more often, one-on-one -on -one and individually, and I can recognize when there are gaps or when I need to reteach something. But I would say the uniting factor in everything that we do is attention to detail and also care for the children. We care for each kid 
It doesn't matter if the entire class is doing well. If one particular student falls behind, that's our main focus. We offer tutoring in the mornings uh, every single day of the week just in order to catch those kids up that are coming in from a different school, maybe missed a day or a couple of weeks. It's great to have small classroom sizes. Coming from public school, our class sizes were really large, so teaching here at a private school, it's really nice. I get more one-on-one -on -one time with my students and I really get to know the ins and outs of how they learn, what they like, what they don't like. I also enjoy getting to see my students grow up and graduate and watch their successes as they go all the way through high school here at DCA. My name is Dennis Coven, Athletic Director at DCA. DCA believes in educational athletics. We want to use this platform to enhance the student's life as they ex have new experiences, relationships, lifelong lessons, and build a spiritual platform that will enhance the quality of the student's lives. DCA has a place for everyone, uh, whether you're more academic or athletic or artistic. Um, there's a place for you here. So our goal through uh, all of the COVID scenarios is to maintain face-to-face -face contact with our students as much as possible. Um, so that's our, our first priority is to be safe in doing that and also provide the students who can't be with us the opportunity to uh, keep up with their classmates and to learn from home. Um, but we think it's, it's important that we stay face-to-face -face with our students uh, um, uh, as long as that is um, realistic and safe for us to do. That's what we're trying to do. Tornado Rebuild, which has been a challenging time for our community, has also been an amazing opportunity here on our campus. We've had a chance to upgrade some of our former facilities. We've had a chance to redo the Brown Gymnasium, for example, from top to bottom. Uh, in addition to that, we're going to try to accomplish two major goals on our campus. And you can see the current construction is already starting to show those two goals starting to happen. And one of those goals is to replace the modular buildings. For 45 years, it's been a discussion on this campus about whether or not modular buildings could be permanently uh, phased out of our school. And so this new wing, this new preschool through fifth grade wing, this new two-story wing, replacing the old one-story elementary wing, gives us the opportunity to permanently uh, replace modular buildings on our campus and have all of our students inside our main building. So that's major goal number one. Major goal number two, which has also been a five-decade discussion here on our campus, is that we've never had a designated performance space, an auditorium space for our performers in the fine arts, to meet for chapels, to host community events, to host our legacy competition where we're the only high school in the state that offers uh, that particular competition. And so some things that are gonna serve our community well from preschool through 12th grade, having an auditorium space, a designated performance space is gonna be amazing for our community. And that's been a 50 year discussion. Donaldson Christian Academy is by far one of the most fabulous private schools, Christian private schools, that I just believe in very strongly, that it has so much to offer. How much the faculty loves the students and wants what's best for them, and how much the students really care about each other and they look out for each other. If you're looking for um, a child care program for your little one, please consider DCA. Uh, we, we have the best out there and we would love to have you part of our family. Another thing that they've also said is they all felt prepped for college. They felt ready when they left DCA. And I think that's one of the most important things is one, you get the spiritual aspect here. But then two, you walk confidently into the world when you leave this place. It's a home. It's a family. It's part of uh, an extension of my family. And I think the reason DCA is such a special place is the people who are there, the people who love and care about each other. You belong at DCA.